Shah Ma Shimru Kakutaj. And that with honors to the elders of Great Millstone who teach well. This video is going to be called E. We all know who that is. E has no salvation at all. E has no salvation at all. The nation of the nation of Edom, the Caucasian, has no salvation. Only destruction. When the Messiah comes back, he's not coming to save them. He's only coming to save the Israelites. And at that, the, the election of Israel, 144,000 men and their wives and their children and nobody else. Edom has no salvation. Let me get a scripture. Lest there be any fornicator or profane person as Esau, who for one morsel of meat sold his birthright. For ye not know that afterward, when he would have inherited the blessing, the kingdom of heaven, he would have inherited the kingdom of heaven, he was rejected. For he found no place of repentance. No place of repentance. He found no place of repentance. He cannot repent. He cannot receive salvation. Although he saw it through carefully through tears. He cried. He cried. Oh, Father, Father. Don't you have a blessing for me? Like the fucking crybaby bitch he is. You did that to yourself, boy. You did, you did that shit to yourself. Cause you're fucking lazy and you're lousy. The only destiny, the only destiny you have for you in the future is captivity. Hard, rigorous captivity. Look what you did to the earth. Look what you did to the people. Look what you've done to the ocean and the air and the trees. Look what it did to the Israelites. And you think you're gonna come up in the kingdom sipping wine all peacefully and shit? What's inside Airborne? A blast of amusement. Fucking ads. Nah. Nah, nigga. You're going into captivity. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that kills with the sword must be killed with the sword. Here is the faith and the patience of the saints. Nigga. Ezekiel 25 and 13. Therefore, thus saith Yahweh, I will stretch out my arm, my hand upon Edom 
I will cut off man and beast from it. I will make it desolate from T-Men. And they have Dedan shall fall by the sword. I will lay my vengeance upon Edom by the, by the hand of my people Israel. And they shall do in Edom according to mine anger and according to my fury. They shall know my vengeance, saith Yehowah. Therefore, saith Yehowah, behold, I will stretch my hand upon the Philistines. I will cut off the cherubims and destroy the remembrance and destroy the remnant of the sea coast. I will execute great vengeance upon upon them with furious rebuke. And they shall know that I am Yahweh. When I shall lay my vengeance upon them, they shall know the Lord's name. They will, Lord, they will know the Lord's name. Regardless. Malachi one and two. I'm going to just start at the beginning. The burden of the word of the Lord. The burden of the word of Yahweh to Israel by Malachi. I have loved you, saith Yahweh. Yet ye say, wherein hast thou loved us? Was not Esau Jacob's brother, saith Yahweh? But I loved Esau. I loved Jacob. Fucking Satan. Trying to fucking twist my tongue. And I hated Esau and laid his mountains and his heritage waste for the dragons of the wilderness. Whereas Edom saith, we are impoverished, but we will return and build in desolate places. Thus saith Yahweh of hosts, they shall build, but I will throw down, I will call them, and they, and they shall call them the border of wickedness and the people of and the people against whom the Lord hath indignation, who hath indignation, hath indignation forever, forever, forever and ever, forever and ever and ever. You have no salvation. You have no salvation, Esau. Stop trying to creep and crawl into our promise, into our blessings. You sold that shit, nigga. You sold that shit. The vision of Obadiah does say, Yahweh concerning Edom. We have heard a rumor from Yahweh, and an ambassador is sent among the heathen. Arise ye, and let us rise up against her and battle. Behold, I have made thee small among the heathen. Thou art greatly despised. The pride in thine heart hath deceived thee. Thou that dwellest in the clefts of the rocks, whose habitation is high, that saith in his heart, Who shall bring me down to the ground? Though thou exalt thyself as the eagle, and though thou set thy nest among the stars, thence will I bring thee down, saith Yahweh. If thieves came to thee, if robbers by night, how art thou cut off? Would they not have stolen till they had enough? If grape, if grape, grape gatherers came to thee, Will they not leave some grapes? 
How are the things of Esau searched out? How are his hidden things sought up? All the men of thy confederacy have brought thee even to the border. The men that were at peace with thee have deceived thee and prevailed against thee. They that eat thy bread have laid a wound under thee. There is none understanding in them. Shall I not in that day, saith Yahweh, even destroy the wise men out of Edom, the so-called Caucasian, the so-called white man? The devil, the, the devil that the Bible speaks of. Shall I not in that day, saith the Lord, saith Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, even destroy the wise men out of Edom and the understanding out of the mount of Esau and thy mighty men, O oh, T men, shall be dismayed to the end that everyone of the mountain Esau may be cut off by slaughter, by slaughter, for the violence against thy brother, for the violence against us, for the violence against the Negroes, the Mexicans, the Native Americans, and the tribes on down. For the robbery, for the lies, for the murder, for the slaughtering, for all the crimes committed, the ones brought to light, and the ones that, that are one, and the ones that are in dark. For the violence against thy brother Jacob, shame shall cover thee. All your crimes will be rubbed in your face. You call black people niggas and thugs, like we're bad, like we brought the earth to its knees. It was not us, you did that, you did that. In the day thou stoodest on the other side, in the day that strangers carried away captives, his forces and foreigners entered into his gates, into the gates, into the gates, and cast lots, and cast lots, what's lots? What's lots? And cast lots upon Jerusalem. Even thou wast one of them. Even thou wast one of them. But thou should not have looked on the day, thou should not look on the day of thy brother. But thou shouldest not have looked on the day of thy brother, in the day that he became a stranger. Neither shouldest thou have rejoiced over the children of Judah in the day of their destruction. Neither shouldest thou have spoken proudly in the day of thy distress. Thou should not have entered into the gate of my people in the day of their calamity. Yet they, thou, thou should not have looked on their affliction in the day of their calamity, nor have laid hands on their substance in the day of their calamity. Neither should have thou have stood on the crossway to cut off those who did escape. Neither should have thou have delivered up those that did remain in the day of their distress. For the day of Yahweh is near, and upon all heathen, as thou hast done, as thou hast done, as thou hast done, it shall be done to thee. All the killing, all the theft, all the rape, all the treachery, all the horribleness, all the terrible things you've done to us, it shall be done to you. And double, and double, and double, and double upon double. For as ye have drunk upon Yahweh's holy mountain, so shall all the heathen continually drink. They shall drink, and they shall swallow down, and they shall be as they had not been. You see all the heathen today, walking proudly, smiling. Ha! Look at you niggas. How can you can't pull yourself up on your bootstrap? Look at you. 
What happened to Zion? What happened to Zion? On this day, when hell, when your hell shy comes back, with the thousands, the thousands, the thousands, and a numeral, a numeral amount of angels. Y'all ain't gonna, y'all ain't gonna, y'all, y'all, y'all's gonna be like you was never in rulership. Like you never had a piece of anything. <sighs> but upon the Mount Zion, but upon Mount Zion, but upon Mount Zion shall be deliverance, and there shall be holiness, and the house of Jacob shall possess their possessions. And the house of Jacob shall be a fire, and the house of Joseph a flame, and the house of Esau for stubble. What stubble? What stubble? What stubble? What's, it's the black shit that you get after you done burnt a campfire. They can't be burnt anymore. It's useless. It can't even be made in the soil. It's shit. It's worthless. And they shall kindle in them and devour them, and there shall be not. And there, and there shall not be any remaining of the house of Esau, for Yahweh have spoken it. What's so hard to understand? What's so hard to get? You have no salvation. You, 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 caucasians. You red men. You red people. You. Pasty, blood skin colored ox! You don't have a chance. 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 Not 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 a chance. Ah. Here you go. Genesis 4, 14. This is the only promise you have, Esau. Behold, thou hast driven me out this day from the earth and from thy face shall I be hid and I shall be a fugitive and a vagabond in the earth and it shall come to pass here it goes, and it shall come to pass that everyone that findeth me shall slay me. Uh, yes. That's what's gonna happen to you. You're gonna be chopped up, forgotten about, kicked in a hole and tossed fire upon you. Who are you? Who are you again? Who? Who? Shalom.